as the disciples were gazing up towards heaven, angels appeared unto them and said, This same Jesus, which is taken up from you into heaven, shall so come in like manner as you have seen him go into heaven. This is your daily devotional, Maranatha, the Lord is coming, with Sister Tanya Nugis. Maranatha, page 199. Martyrs in the Last Days, July 10th. They shall put you out of the synagogues. Yea, the time cometh that whosoever killeth you will think that he doth God's service. John 16, verse 2. Every individual in our world will be arrayed under one of two banners. The two armies will stand distinct and separate, and this distinction will be so marked that many who shall be convinced of the truth will come on the side of God's commandment-keeping people. When this grand work is to take place in the battle, prior to the last closing conflict, many will be imprisoned, Many will flee for their lives from cities and towns, and many will be martyrs for Christ's sake and standing in defense of the truth. By the decree, enforcing the institution of the papacy in violation of the law of God, our nation, the United States, will disconnect herself fully from righteousness. As the approach of the Roman armies was assigned to the disciples of the impending destruction of Jerusalem, so may this apostasy be a sign to us that the limit of God's forbearance is reached, that the measure of our nation's iniquity is full, and that the angel of mercy is about to take her flight never to return. The people of God will then be plunged into those scenes of affliction and distress which prophets have described as a time of Jacob's trouble. The cries of the faithful, persecuted ones ascend to heaven. And as the blood of Abel cried from the ground, there are voices also crying to God from martyrs' graves, from the sepulchres of the sea, from mountain caverns, from convent vaults. How long, O Lord, holy and true, dost thou not judge and avenge our blood on them that dwell on the earth? When the fifth seal was opened, John the Revelator in vision saw beneath the altar the company that were slain for the word of God and the testimony of Jesus Christ. After this came the scenes described in the 18th of Revelation, when those who are faithful and true are called out from Babylon, Christ will restore the life taken, for He is the life giver. He will beautify the righteous with immortal life. This has been your daily devotional with Sister Tanya Nuges. Maranatha, Jesus is coming again. Get ready. Get ready, get ready.